Medford with Medford Knife and Tool. They say third time's a charm. This is my third attempt at this video. You know, there are some days where it just rolls off the tongue and some days where it gets stuck. And today's a stuck day for me. Anyway, knives on the table today headed to Richard Kane at Gromit's Knife and Carry. He's in Moreno Valley, California, and he will be attending the California Custom Knife Show, which is October 22nd and 23rd. So that's coming up shortly here. It is at the Embassy Suites on Harbor Boulevard in Garden Grove, California. Lovely place to be, I think very close to Disneyland, so if you want to do a trip, bring the family. Everybody has a little something cool going on. If you want to reach out to Richard, his number is 951-697-6468, and let's see what awesomeness is headed his way. <clears throat> I'm going to start with the M48, one of our best-selling new knives, and I'm going to say this has been around for two years now. It has just taken off like hotcakes. It's got such a light, light feel to it. I'm going to liken it to the Slim Midi Marauder because it's got super slim material and the carry in the pocket is very light compared to our more traditional sturdy heavy titanium frame locks. This is a hybrid in the sense that it's half titanium, half aluminum. So it looks like it's all PVD but this is hard anodized black. We have flamed hardware, PVD clip, PVD spring and blade. So that's an M48 blackout with flamed hardware. Micro Praetorian T, a great everyday carry knife. This is a knife I typically carry, although today I'm carrying an Eris. But my favorite knife to carry is a Micro Praetorian, and this one's PVD Tonto, PVD hardware clip and breaker with blue handles. Classic, you can't go wrong with that. Genesis T, S35 tumbled draw point blade with blue handles, standard hardware clip and breaker. And this is a minor upgrade. The PVD coated handles are an upgrade cost, but still no sculpting, so it's relatively affordable in our scope of expensive custom knives. Tumbled blade, tumbled spring, I'm sorry, tumbled clip, standard hardware, and PVD handles. Here we go. Here's a full custom. We have a satin drop point blade, blue stained glass sculpted handles, standard hardware, and a brushed silver clip. So silver and blue. And the last Genesis T, I would say this is probably the most desirable or sought after because of the Vulcan blade. Beautiful Vulcan drop point blade, faced bronze, falling leaf handles, PVD breaker, flamed hardware and brush and flamed clip. And then we have, I think the middies on the table are just absolutely stellar. This one here, stained glass, firstly is one of my favorite sculpting. And I love the PVD coating with the brushed off flats. It's a brush, of a bronze rose color that really goes nicely with that Tonto blade. I love the Tonto on the midi. Flamed hardware, PVD breaker, and a brush and flame clip. Super sexy. This one here, the dimples, I mean this is also another one of my favorites. I love the different size dimpling on it. We have just very microscopic sized little dimples and large and medium. Gives it really cool character. PVD with brushed rose flats and just a spectacular, very colorful Vulcan drop point blade. Then we have a full size Marauder H. Now the Marauder H is defined by the thinner blade in relation to the full thick Marauder, which is 0 0.260. So this is a 0 0.190 inch thick Vulcan blade. This does have the full size Marauder handles though. You'll see how clean the sculpting looks on that. That's because these are Marauder handles which is the same thickness as the Marauder H, just different machining on them. Standard silver Predator sculpting, dark flamed hardware, and a brushed and flamed clip. Very nice. USMC Fighter Flipper, Terminator. No bells or whistles on this bad boy. Just all Terminator, standard. If you want something very basic, that is the knife for you. Second USMC Fighter Flipper, this one's Magna Cut. There's the M, the first one, the Terminator was S35. Faced and galaxy flamed handle, brass bronze hardware, a brush brass bronze pommel, and a brushed and galaxy flamed clip. And then here, another Magna Cut, tumbled blade. We have PVD handles with that laurel leaf filigree. My newest favorite laser engraving. I love how it's ghosted on there. You just see the outline. Again, that brass bronze hardware, a brushed brass bronze clip on the flats with PVD base and a brushed bronze clip. And there's that little leaf on the back side. <laughs> I love that. I was just gonna swear, I'm sorry I swear like a pirate, I'm sure you guys don't mind that too much, but you know, 
you just can't help it sometimes because you get so freaking excited. So Richard Kane promets check out uh, his new place. I don't have the address for it written down. We are going to update that on our card so I can uh, give that in our videos. But do check him out at the California Custom Night Show. His booth number will be listed on the video when it goes live. And uh, that's about all I have for you today. Take it easy and until the next time. Peace.